Hey guys and welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. Today we have level 80 Jean. We're going to be going over her stats, talking about potential weapons, potential artifacts, and of course some gameplay. Let's go ahead and jump right into the video. Alright, first off, we have about 19k HP and 2200 attack, that's pretty good, running about 53% critical rate, 100% critical damage, we got about 134% energy recharge and 37.7% physical damage. Alright, now for weapons, I'm running the Aquila Favonia, this is the best 5 star for Jean, but obviously not everyone's gonna have this, your second choice is going to be the Black Sword, but most likely you're using this sword on somebody else, so the last thing you want to go for is a Prototype Rancor, this is a free to play weapon, so definitely give this a shot for Jean, you can also refine 5 it. The actual skill isn't the greatest thing ever, but it is fine and it goes physical damage, so I highly recommend this sword for Jean. Next up, we have artifacts. I'm currently going the full gladiator set. You can do a two piece bloodstained, but since you can go full bloodstained, I don't really recommend it because it does boost charge attacks, which you don't really want to be doing too much on Jean. You can do a two piece blood stain and then a two piece gladiator, but honestly just going for the 35% on a full gladiator is going to be so much better. Now for my pieces, I'm going critical rate, critical damage, this piece is really good. And uh, for the feather, we have more critical damage, no critical rate, unfortunately, we'll definitely work on this piece. Uh, this one right here, it goes critical dam I mean critical rate, but no critical damage, and two of its stats are actually really bad, but will definitely improve over time. You do want to be going attack for this one, going uh, physical damage percent if you get it for this piece. But I do know that the gladiator pieces, it's really hard to get the piece you actually want, because you can't really grind um, gladiator pieces, you just kind of get them from world bosses and weekly bosses. So if you get it, you get it. If not, then you can just run something like I have right here, like a purple attack piece. It's not the best, but it'll do for now. Now for the hat, I'm currently going critical rate. The substats are terrible, but it does give energy recharge and her Q does heal. So as of now, it's not the worst thing ever, but you definitely want to uh, get better substats to have critical rate, critical damage. All right, and for her talents, I currently have level 6 on her basic attack. This is what I use the most for Jean. When you get Wind Companion, this will start healing you. Uh, for her Q, it's only level 3, but at level 3, it pretty much full heals me anyways. So I didn't really think I needed to waste more resources on making it even better when it does its job uh, already. So uh, her E, only level 1, I use this as a repositioning tool. I don't really care what damage it does, so it's probably going to stay level 1 for a while. Alright, so we're at floor level 10, and we're going to see what Jean is capable of. So she's doing about 400 heals a tick, about 3 to 4k damage on criticals, and 1 to 2k non critical. Animal damage is actually still really good for some reason. I guess it's because of her high attack. But yeah, Jin can easily solo this with no problem while having full HP. I'm actually very impressed with her uh, survivability.
All right, just to sum up the video, Jean is fantastic. The only reason I might see people having uh, issues with her is that she doesn't have like a definite job. What I mean by that is Deluke, all he does is DPS. Kaching, all she does is DPS. Chi Chi, heal, and so on. But the thing with uh, Gina is she can support, she can heal, she can DPS, she can tank, she can do everything for you. And uh, maybe that makes uh, her doesn't shine as much. And that's what tier lists usually look at. But if we're talking about versatility, I say Jean definitely takes the crown. But anyways, that is going to be it for me. If you guys do enjoy this kind of content, make sure you sub and press that like button. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.